Good day. So now we'll, uh, we'll discuss cryptography. Cryptography is the study of methods to write and solve secret codes. And the process of encoding messages through secret codes is called encryption. Meaning when we do encryption, you cannot read the exact message. So it's unreadable. So there is no sense in reading the uh, message okay? because it's encrypted. So it has no sense. So cryptographic programs prevent hackers from using your email address or making calls using your mobile number to access private information. Now, the first one, uh, the first crypto system that we'll be discussing is the Cesar cipher. So which is the first crypto system used by Julius Cesar in sending messages to his troops. The process contains these two steps. Number one is assign each letter of the English alphabet with integers from 0 to 25. So we have this. Okay, so A is 0, B is 1, C is 2, until Z to 25. Now to in encrypt the message, replace a letter of the message in position I, so this one, by the letter in position 3. So that is 0 plus 3. 0 plus 3 is 3. 1 plus 3 is 4. 2 plus 3 is 5. And so on. Okay. So meaning number 3, which is D. Number 3 is D. So A will become D. E, which is 4. So B will become E. F. Uh, C will become F and so on so in short this position from 3 to 25 it will just move three places to the left okay so three places to the left meaning z will become or will move to w so w now is z Hence, in encrypting a message, we will now be using this table. Note, from uh, when we say encryption, so it is the process by which a readable message is converted to unreadable. So we go from blue to gray. And when we convert it back to from unreadable message to readable message, we use this de decryption. No? So that it's the process of converting an encrypted message back to its original format. So from gray to blue. So the original message is called the plain text message. Example, encrypt the message mathematics. So this is now our message, mathematics. Okay. So to encrypt this one, we go from the blue to the gray. Take note, M is P. So that's why we write it P. A is D, so that's why it's D. T, T is W, so T is W. H is K. E is H. M again is P. A is D. T again is W. I, I is L. C is F, and then S is V. So therefore, this is now our unreadable message or the encrypted message. P, D, W, K, H, P, D, W, L, F. Another message, encrypt the message, we are close to victory. So we are close to victory. So again, it's it encryption, so from blue to gray. So W is Z. E, e is H. A is D. R is U. E is H again. If C, C is F. L is O, O is R, S is V, E is H, T is W, O is R, 
V is Y, I is L, C is F, T is W, O is R, R is U, and Y is B. So therefore, this is now our encrypted message for we are close to victory. Okay, you may try to encrypt the message below. I am child. I am a child of God. So now let's go now to decryption. So decrypt the message. This one. So we will go from the gray one to the blue one. So since this is decryption, so we will look at first the bottom letters. So P. So P is M. So this one P is M. D, D is A, W, W is T, that is why it's T, K, K is H, H is E, P again is M, D is A, W is T, L, what is L, L is I, F is C, and V is v v v is s so that is why we have mathematics the next one we has we have l v so l is i v is s so is and then this one we have e e is b h is e d is a x is u w is t l is i i is f X is U, and then O is L. Therefore, the original message is mathematics is beautiful. Okay, so if you want to encrypt a message, you go from the blue one, right, uh, upper letter to lower letter. And if you want to decrypt the message, then of course, we go, you go from the lower one, the lower letter to the upper letter. So your turn, so decrypt this message. So the next uh, crypto system is the decimation cipher. So a decimation cipher encrypts a message by multiplying each value of the encrypted message by a fixed number. Take note, by a fixed number. So again, the steps are, so the first one is to assign uh, numbers from 0 to 25 to each letter so this one so the same with the cesar cipher a is 0 up to z is 25 then select an odd integer p between 3 and 25 inclusive so meaning 3 and 25 are included except 13 because 13 and 26 have the same or have the same factors so make sure that p and 26 are relatively prime meaning they don't have the same factors and then last replace a letter in the message with a position value i with the letter of the numerical value i times p mod 26 so to understand this further let's have this example encrypt the message biology is a natural science using the decimation cipher with p equals 5. So, of course, we will start first with the message. Biology is a natural science. Then let's write the position, the original position. So, B is 1, I is 8, O is 14, L is 11, again, O is 14, G is 6, Y is 24, and so on. So these are now the original position of the letters based on this table. Next, we will multiply all of these numbers by 5 since our P is 5. So 1 times 5 is 5. 8 times 5 is 40. 14 times 5 is 70. 11 times 5 is 55. 14 times 5 is 70, 6 times 5 is 30, 24 times 5 is 120, and so on. So these are the numbers. Next is we'll get the 
modulo. So, IP, I times P, modulo 26. So, the numbers here will divide it by 26. So, it's, if it's below 26, then the number stays. So, 5 is below 26, so it stays 5. 40 modulo 26 is 14. Take note from our previous previous uh, video, we've discussed that when we talk about modulo, it's just the remainder. So, say for example, 40 divided by uh, 26, since this is modulo 26. So, take note, this is just uh, 40 divided by 26. So, it's just 1 times 26 is 26. So, we have 14. So, cannot be. So, meaning the remainder is 14. And in modulo, 40 mod 40 mod 26. Take note that the answer is just the remainder. So, the, rem the answer here is 14. Okay. So, that is why the value here is 14. Another example, say for example, 70. 70 divided by 26. So this is 2 times 26 is 52. 10 minus 2 is 8. This is now 6 minus 5 is 1. So 18. 70 minus 52 is 18. So this is now our remainder. So therefore, 70 mod 26 is equal to 18. Okay? Again, so you do 55 divided by 26. Last example for this. 55 divided by 55 divided by 26. So there are 2 because 26 times 2 is 52. So the remainder is 3. That is why the answer here is 3. So you do the same. 70 divided by 26. The remainder is 18. 30 divided by 26. The remainder is 4. 120 divided by 26. The remainder is 16. And so on. So all of these are just the remainder from modulo 26. Therefore, the encrypted message is now this one. We'll be using this again. So, what is 5? Five? 5 is F. O, uh, 14. 14. 14. 14 is O. 18 is S. 3 is D. 18 is S. 4. 4 is E. 16 is Q. Okay, and so on. Okay. Therefore, the encrypted message for biology is a natural science is this one. FOS, DS, EQ, OM, A, N, A, R, W, H, A, D, M, K, O, U, N, K, U. Okay. So what if we go the other way around? Before, but before that, we'll be, uh, we'll have this note that this is the decimation decryption values. So if we go from encryption, uh, in encrypting a message, we'll be using this, either of these, and then say for example, in encrypting a message, this is five. Okay, so we used five to give the encrypted message. Now, to decrypt this one, when we say decrypt, we will reverse the process from the encrypted message to the original message. We will use this decryption value. So, meaning, if it's 5, we'll be using 21. Okay, so, we'll be using 21. So, in any case, uh, it's either P or J will be given in a problem. So let's try. So 
take note this is five so we'll just go from the encrypted message to the original message let's try if we can reach the biology is a natural science so we'll be using js25 so but before that you may uh, try to encrypt the message god is love using the decimation cipher and of course let p be equal to three Okay, so let's have this. So this is now the given encryption. So actually this one is this, the bottom of this previous example. So let's try if this will work. So we'll, since it's five, so we'll be using now for decryption, we'll be using 21 with J equals 21. So this is the original message, okay, which is the decrypted message a while ago. So the position is since F, F is five, O is 14, S is 18, D is 3, S is 18, and so on. Okay, so the position or the positions are based on this table. Next is, again, to multiply the position and our J. Okay, so 5 times 21 is 105. 14 times 21 is 294. 18 times 21 is 378. 3 times 21 is 63. 18 times 37. Uh, 18 times 21 is 378, and so on. So all of these numbers here must be multiplied to 21 to get these values. Okay. Next is to get the modulo of 26. Okay, modulo 26. So 105 divided by 26. So example, 105 divided by 26. So it's 4. 4 times 6 is 24. Carry 2. 4 times 2 is 8 plus 2 is 10. So we have 105 minus 104, 1. So the remainder is 1. So that is why we have 1 here. Okay, so you just do the same what we did here. Okay, take the modulo, meaning the remainder. The answer is the remainder. So 294 divided by 26, the remainder is 8. 378 divided by 26, the remainder is 14. 63 divided by 26 is 11. The remainder is 11. So 63 divided by 26 so this is 2 2 times 26 is 52 so 63 minus 52 is 11 so that is why 63 divided by 26 the remainder is 11 and so on so all of these are modulo 26 so the remainders when we divide these numbers by 26, the remainders are this one. Okay? So therefore, the original message or the decoded message is this. So 1 is B, 8 is I, 14 is O, 11 is L, 14 is O, 6 is G, and 24 24 24 is y so we have biology okay and you may check that these other numbers here represents i s a n a t u r a l s c i e n c e so biology is a natural science okay so thank you for listening